Hey guys, welcome back to the 5R Show. I'm your host, Raymond, and today we have massive unboxing number 70. That's right, we've got eight packages for you. Three of them are these small little envelopes. I've got three little boxes and I've got two big boxes. Now, unfortunately, I didn't get to complete everything I needed and or wanted. And I missed out on a few listings that could have helped. Uh, but we did get most of it. And so we will start projects. We already have, but we'll start projects with what we've got. And uh, one of them is already underway. Very cool project coming up very soon. But anyway, uh, so today, unboxing number 70, eight packages. Let's get started right away. All right, first up is, uh, yeah, this one, sure. Okay, I don't wanna, yeah, see, okay. Cut it from the bottom. There we go. Okay, this one came up. And, yeah, there it is. Okay, almost threw that away. <gasps> oh. Okay, so that's that. No, he didn't. Did he? What the hell? Oh, man, I got swindled. Yeah, speaking of swindle. I got swindled. So I picked up a couple of Constructicon. Oh man, did I just... No, he didn't sell me this broken piece. Oh man, did I ever get swindled. He made a propeller for it or something. Wow, somebody swindled me. Oh well. I better pay more closer attention to that. That sucks. That's not the correct piece. That's probably why nobody bought it. No matter. We'll figure something out. It's always good to have spare parts. But I was counting on that vortex, so it doesn't matter now. And then, of course, a swindle, which in this case actually feels appropriate. <laughs> I got swindled. But anyway, okay, so there's that one. Let's go on to the next one. And here we go. Yes. Another air raid, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I know you guys are wondering maybe why. So many air raids, right? Let's check it out. The condition of it is not that bad. It's, it's in pretty decent shape, too. It's actually not it's super bad. The wings aren't floppy or anything. It's actually in decent condition. The wings are nice. So, well, it's warm, but it's in good condition. So, there's that air raid. So, you're wondering why I'm buying so many air raids. That's the project that's coming up soon. Okay, let's go on to the next one. Here we go. Let's see. All right. Let's see how bad this one is. Yep, that's what I thought. Okay, so the wings are broken. Wow, look at that. In this case, it really is broken. I think they hit it pretty well in the auction because I didn't see that. Well, it doesn't matter. Oh, this one is snapped too? Jeez, that's not good. Well, we're going to have to figure something out. But anyway... There's that. I was really hoping these wings were intact 
so that's not good but anyway let's get on to the next one so uh, well first of all you guys know who this is this is star saber that is not a good sign though that's not a good thing but anyway so be it times are getting tough people are just i don't know okay let's see let's pull this it's the walking cat Nickel. And let's see here. Let's cut this one here. And over here. And here we are. Let's see. Yeah. Oh, brother. Okay. Now you guys see what I was trying to go for, right? But it doesn't matter. We'll work with what we've got. I always see these, and it's kind of sad, but it's, it's kind of strange, too. Some parts are nicer. Some parts are worse. Um, but it's okay. We'll figure something out. So, yeah, another star saver. Okay. Let's go on to the next one, guys. The Mercari one. Go shopping. And very plainly and easily. I lucked out on this guy. It was somewhere in the afternoon, and somebody just said, uh, you know what, I'm gonna post these for 12 bucks. And when I saw it, it was it'd been posted for two minutes. Somebody put a like on it, and I was like, what? A like? Okay, well, you can watch me as I purchase it. And, of course, I purchased it. Okay, so, in Japan, one of the things about these uh, Power Master Prime parts, God Master, God Bomber parts, too, is sometimes the post is broken on some of these. But these are actually in very decent condition. The wings for the God Bomber are in really nice condition. Look at that. They're very decent. I'm going to guess these are reissues, but I can't be 100% sure. Um, but, nevertheless, very beautiful pieces that we need. And, of course, an extra Optimus Prime gun. So I got this for 1200 yen, which was steel deal that was a great deal especially since i just got swindled over there <laughs> anyway uh, let's go on to the next one and uh yeah we're breezing through these because we've got videos to uh edit and projects to get back to just busy uh, okay here we go yes this one is also another find that I got and it's not that it was a great deal but it was how do you say why is there tape on this thing hmm. it was um, something that I needed and of course good so I had suspected this one would be broken but it is not but it is different wow it's different why Oh, wow, that's strange. I've never seen that variation. Hmm. Okay, so I'll show you guys. So this one has the... Um, the post. The post here. Um, however, this one has a shorter post. And or... The post has been uh, reinforced as compared to these. You can see the. So, yeah, we, ladies and gentlemen, we've got a variation. You can see the, the, the reinforcement of the posts. So, this post here has a reinforcement 
all the way around but these have a shorter reinforcement I never knew that that's on that's just uh, new to me I never seen that variation I can't find a number inside the gun uh, I'm guessing maybe this is vintage could be that this is vintage could be that these are modern especially in the the way it, it's assembled it seems like this could be a vintage part and these might me be the reissue ones nevertheless i never knew about that little uh variation so that's interesting to see so anyway so yeah so i got that i've got um an arm for the god bomber and of course a spare head so i'm missing the cab for a second power master prime and a few more parts for another god bomber okay and so now we went through these six unboxings really quickly you can see there but now let's get into the two large ones so let's scoot all that over and let's get started with the other two large ones all right here we go this is the large box let's get cracking can't see so go so i picked this up and it was a bargain steal this was just awesome it was 1600 yen shipped so that comes to american about eight nine dollars shipped cannot beat that bargain guys you cannot beat that bargain for a lyo convoy that's right at that. That's just awesome. Got a Lyle Convoy for 10 bucks. Say what? You heard. A Lyle Convoy for 10 bucks. And then, um, it's, it's not, yeah, it's yellowed. I am not worried about that. But look at that. That's cool. Now, for some reason, <laughs> it gets yellowed here, but not here. Th these must be different plastic for real. It's like a rubbery type of plastic. Oh, it is. Look at that. So this is a rubbery type of plastic. However, this is a ABS. Well, it's a harder type of plastic. I'm not sure what it is. Uh, nevertheless, it is a lyo convoy let's put this up here there we go i i still haven't even had a chance to mess with this toy and i already have two of them i guess but uh but i'm not sure how oh, okay no yeah i don't know how this goes but yeah so anyway um Oh. Oh, these are wheels. I didn't even know those were wheels. Seems like they were trying to cut it here. Well, doesn't matter. It's fine. But yeah, that's that's cool. So for a few bucks, I got this Lyle convoy. 
That's pretty cool, guys. Look at that. All right. Now, let's go on to the next unboxing, which is actually the last one for a while. Like I said, we want to get into the projects. We already started. And last unboxing for a while, guys. You know, it's funny and what's sad at the same time is that I had actually bought this piece from the same guy I bought that Lyle Convoy from. Wow, that's so scary. So it is, it's got a little bit of sunburn on the blue on one of the wings. Uh, it's got stickers, but in the wrong area. That's supposed to go on the front of the nose, but for some reason they put it there. The yellowing, of course, is very evident. <laughs> you can see that, which is no problem. Uh, this one was the equivalent of 18 bucks, I believe. And it's got the head and everything. Let's pull this guy out. Hey guys, I'm having a problem getting this guy out for some reason. And these wings are really, really floppy. Wow. Okay, that's nice. Fun. Whew. All right. Okay, so the wings are okay. You know what? They put the stickers over the gold chrome which means that the gold chrome might be well protected under those stickers so that's actually a good sign now the wings are floppy but we can switch them out you can see where the yellowing starts and you know ends but the wings are in great shape except those arms so yeah we can repair using some of those right that's that was the point um but there's other reasons for the other ones yeah look at that the yelling is so bad so we're gonna have to make a really really beautiful one out of all this junk and there is our star saver look at that let's see Wow, that is incredible, guys. Look at that. The little guy is really white. That's good news. Wow, that, that looks better than mine. So the Brain Master is in really decent shape. Now, obviously, you guys saw the last video where we had a um, just a brain figure unboxing because you can you, you're never going to find them uh sold by themselves that's really rare so when i found it i picked it up in a heartbeat but yeah so this one's in beautiful shape uh some of the parts here are in beautiful shape the cockpit itself is in great shape you know uh the paint on it everything so there are parts on this toy that are in really good shape we can use um for instance, this one, we can switch out parts and just, uh, you know, do our best to make it look better. Now, here's the thing is that uh, originally I was going to create a second Star Saber. However, this part is broken and it didn't show that, didn't see that. You have to be careful when you're buying online. It is the toy I bought, but it's not what I expected. So it, this is fine, though. I'm not worried about this part. Um, 
however this is beautiful beautiful condition so that's what i'm saying is we're gonna piece together the nice little stickery ones nice little minty one whatever we can do and put it all together and we'll have a really nice one. Oh, popped out already well that's actually good for me okay so but anyway yeah so that's what we're gonna do um i'm not worried about that guys uh what it is is that uh remember we got a metal hawk in one of the last unboxings well that's what i wanted some of these for so we might be making custom wings so we're gonna have to clean this edge off i mean it's pretty much gone anyway right there's nothing you can do and then we're gonna have to trim this piece and add parts to it so that's what the mission is that's what we want to do anyway We've got three Star Sabers, guys. Wow, look at that. So they've been selling the parts quite a bit. And, you know, beautiful, beautiful white condition. That's the way you want your toys. But Brain Master Power. <laughs> very cool fee gimmick, very cool feature. Uh, so yeah, so that's for today's unboxing. We've got a couple of combiner toys, a bunch of Power Master Prime parts, as you can see there. And of course, we've got our Star Saber here and our Lyo Convoy. So that does it for today's um, massive unboxing number 70. Awesome parts, pieces, and toys. And like I said, we've already started on projects and we're gonna get into that. We already started. And that's what we're gonna be focusing on from here on out for sure. So anyway, thank you for watching. Thank you for coming to the show. Uh, if you haven't yet, please consider subscribing to the channel. Share, like, comment, let us know what you think. Have you ever owned any Japanese Transformers? And if you have, which ones do you like the most? Uh, and with that, I say God bless you. Take care in the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Take care of yourselves and each other. And I will gladly see you guys on the next episode of 5-Hour Show. Take care, guys. Have a good one. See you next time.